Hi guys, it's Moz here and on the workbench today, I've got something a little bit different. This is the mini four-wheel drive Honda E 132nd scale kit from Tamiya. I don't normally build these sort of models. Um, they just don't interest me, but for £10 from Japan to the to UK, I think the website's called, they have this on offer. And so I thought, well, for a teller plus one ninety nine shipping, it was worth a little crack at. So it came about two weeks ago after, I think about four days on the delivery. And I thought we'll have a little go at reviewing this and let's have a build and see what we get. And as I said, I don't build these sort of kits. These are basically their um, mini kits and uh, they snap together. So there's no glue required. There's a motor inside, no paint, but we're not gonna paint it. We're just gonna build it straight from the box. It does require some AA batteries, which aren't included, but it's just a bit of fun really for building this. Now, if you don't know much about the Honda E, it's a mass produced type of electric car from Honda. And it was unveiled back in 2019 and made its debut in August, 2020. And it's become a 132nd scale mini car. And uh, so that's basically the book from the website. Let's have a look at the box first. So you've got a lovely little bit of box art there showing you the car. And those are the, the rollers on the front and back, which you can take off or don't even use. Um, it even comes with stickers. 132, it's called a VZ chassis. On the side of this kit, basically, I'm oh, sorry, the side of the box, it's basically telling you it's got an ABS resin chassis, so it should have a bit of clout to it. So if you do bang it around, it shouldn't break. And that's basically, there's the motor and there's the tires. But it's high performance VZ chassis, holds for attachment of FRP and carbon stays and plates, and a multi part front bumper. That's what it says on the side of that set box. This side, you've got the picture, and then you've got the model number, which is 180951100. Also on the side, it's saying here you need some batteries, and um, it's officially licensed by Honda, which is pretty cool. Recommended tools are some side cutters, some tweezers and a screwdriver M. I'll have a look at them in a minute, but it's basically ready to assemble precision model kit. You can paint it, but I don't think you need to. And again, on the side of the box, you've got the artwork again. So we open up the box. Also, I've taken the instructions out because I want to have a little look and see what we get. But inside of the box, you're going to get a load of parts, obviously. And each are pretty much bagged up apart from the little bits there. In this pack here is the electric motor and all the gearing that you need, some poly clips there, obviously. Remember, there's no need to actually glue this kit. So you'll have to cut all the bits off the sprue and just give them a tidy up, obviously. But you can see then it, it looks pretty smart, actually, to be fair. It does look quite smart. So there's the body. Look at that yellow crumbs. Fluorescent yellow, obviously. Um, Tamiya, that's, that, this is um, basically sprue D or frame D and some bits and pieces there. So I'm presuming the stickers go on the top here so that, you know, you, there's no actual um, plastic parts or clear plastic parts. It's all covered up by the stickers. So there's that bit there. We'll have a look at the body. There's the shell. And you've got an on and off uh, button there. It's 2019, so it's only three year old, this kit. No flash on this whatsoever. Looking pretty smart. You get some rubber tires as well, which is always a good thing. I always think rubber tires on any kit above 148 scale, even above um, 132 is good to have rubber tires. Don't always come, and there's the the uh, the wheels as well. So you put the rubber on the wheels. Quite a simple looking build. You get stickers, not transfers, or the water decals on this one. So you just stick the uh, stickers on, pretty nice. It's almost like a quick build, but it's not Lego. <laughs> Don't mention the Lego word. Also comes with a, with an array of stickers of a numbers array of numbers um, in sticker form so you can put them anywhere you like um, all the all the uh, do's and don'ts when you put in the model together instruction manual obviously <clears throat> it is giving you the option to to spray this if you so wish but I'm not going to bother it's going to build it straight out of the box as apparently you can do the um, there's some um, tools there you need some side cutters a screwdriver medium some tweezers and there you go there's some spray paint so that's going to be the build 
of this kit, which I'm looking forward to. But before I build this, and I'm gonna do it as a time lapse, would you do us a favor? If you're liking the content on this channel, will you please just subscribe by clicking subscribe, then click the bell, select all, and you'll never miss another video from this channel. And it really does help if you also can like the video. And if it's something you will be looking forward to build, um, why don't you leave a comment below? Just say, cool, this is a good kit. I like to build it or something like that. Give us a reason in the comments why you like to build it. Anyways, that's it from me. Let's get on and build this kit.
So this build took me exactly 56 minutes from everything from beginning to very end. What an interesting, lovely little build. It is so simple, it just clicks together. I had no issues whatsoever with this kit, apart from one thing, the stickers. <laughs> As you can see, I just didn't quite get it right, and I'm, I'm not able to rub that bloody crease out. But everything else has come through absolutely lovely. Now, it only goes forwards, obviously, so you turn them on, there he is on. I let him go so you can see all wheels moving. There it is, four wheels. And if I put him off to the side here, let him go, off he goes. Off he goes. Really what? There you go, really nice. Then you've got to turn him off. An interesting thing was you want to change the battery. It is so simple on this. This is brilliant, right? You've got a little clip here. And, what, and as you can, I don't know if you can see it in the camera here, but if you just twist it to the right, push it to the right, this comes off, little clip comes off, and then you've got like a half and half there, and now it comes, there you go, splits apart, and then here you've got your battery, so you just unclip there, which side is it, that side or the other side, this side I think, unclip, and you take the batteries out. It's so simple that when you put it back together again, make sure that the bubble is the right way. It does actually fit in one way. So it goes in click, and then clicks over. There you go, into position. That should really just swing, okay? So that swings open, and then you just push them in, click, and there's the battery done. Again, little clip on the front there. That slots in the front here. I can get it there he is and then again same position again at the back push this in into position and twist him straight and that's it lock position fantastic but what a marvelous build doesn't it look nice i'll just show you from all the angles here i've taken some pictures as well obviously so you can see um you could put some stickers on i'm not going to bother at the moment there is um a place to put a number plate if you don't have these on i've not put the number plate on here so i don't really feel it's necessary but anyways it doesn't matter because it's now built the honda e what's your thoughts on this kit is this the sort of kit you would like to build let me know in the comments It'd be good to get in some sort of uh, debate but as i said 10 pound plus 199 shipping you know so 11.99 you've got yourself quite a nice looking little model there from tamia easy build easy click and it's got some power if you want to race it down the road but I, I suggest you don't because it will hit something and break probably because it is quite a fast little kit. <clears throat> Losing my voice here a little bit. Anyways, if you so like the video, click like. If you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe, ring that bell, select all, and you'll be notified when I release a new video. Any questions, any comments, put them in the box below because I do reply. And a big, huge shout out to my channel members. Thank you so much for being a member. They are all named on the screen. If you'd like to become a channel member, just click join membership start from 199. Thanks for watching. If you'd like to see my latest video, click here. If you'd like to see a playlist of my catalogs, click here.